like so i already had went with like a shortened version of my name of my dead name uh and i already went by that so if like someone said my full name they either didn't know me or it was my dad and i was in trouble uh so like i already had the one syllable like nickname that i could have ran with um but for me yeah. in my head and it, would, it was even kind of neutral but in my head uh you know i heard the full thing and it was just not it so even though i wanted to use it i i really couldn't and then i even tried to use like that syllable with names together and it was just none of them were coming together the way they were supposed to at all and uh and i just i went on like to a baby book like website and was like going down baby names and literally aaron is like a a it's like the first freaking name that popped up and i was like in my head i'm like okay i can see how that would be affirming for me and then i also thought to myself this would be an easy way for my family and my like unsupportive family to be able to say my name and in their head they can think e and i can hear a and it would be a mutual understanding or me meeting them in the middle so so they would so they would say aaron but be thinking e-r-i-n like the girl aaron making them feel better right that was what you were thinking okay right and so i immediately put those two together and was like that's fine i can work with that like maybe that'll get them to you know to do it and so in retrospect i am like definitely sad that i made my name like so to someone else you know what i mean like 50 percent factored in of someone else's opinion um mm -hmm. so that was a little that was something that i didn't really love but then i it started to grow on me and i was like i you know i i like it everyone's already calling like everyone's got it like a lot of my friends and gotten in like family members or not family members but like um my friends family members and stuff mm -hmm. would use it and like my brother would and um so I, it ended up being pretty good for me uh i wanted to my, i wanted my name to be daniel because um but i didn't use that name because i had a, one of my best friends was named daniel so oh. i was like i immediately felt like i was just like duplicating even though for me when i was a child um if i were to like go out and go out in the yard and i was getting dirty or i was like playing pretend or whatever i would flip my hat backwards and i would say that my name was dan the man so if someone had asked me if i did that i'd be like no I, no that's not me that's no nope, no nope, that wasn't me dan the man did it or whatever so it was like my <laughs> own personal like little alter ego i guess that i named myself probably in like the second grade uh, and I grew up in a, like a very um, unsupportive, like to the LGBT environment, very conservative. Uh, but my Nana did, um, she thought it was funny, you know, she was just like, you know, whatever, like let the kid do what they want, you know, like, she, you know, they're having fun, whatever. Um, so love Nana. Yeah, Nana was really good and she just, you know, just let me do my thing and let me get dirty and she would just take it as a, a laundry challenge to get it out of my clothes and stuff. So I oh wanted my to name myself Dan Daniel after myself being named Dan the Man, uh, which was an early, early sign, early, early sign of uh, being trans for me. Um, yeah. But yeah, so I ended up just using it as my middle name to kind of like bridge so I could still use it but not use it as my first um but yeah i don't i don't yeah I, I just i didn't have at the time i didn't have the courage to deal with the people shaking their heads when i changed my name so i didn't mm -hmm. do it. i didn't do it right and you did it you know what i'm saying yeah so, so if you're listening and you're like thinking about like how to choose your name please make sure that you're 100 percent doing it for what your heart feels right for you yes. as as a person and not to like satisfy someone else or even like kind of think about that as like a pro you know in the situation like use it for your body and your soul and like you as a person on the inside because if you don't i feel like you'll i feel you'll wish you did you know like yeah even, even like with what with what you did like to change your name like you knew that was right and now you fucking love your name and i, I love fucking love name. your name and like 
You know what I mean? So it's perfect. Yeah. I love that. Yeah. And I, I've, well, I've really grown to love my name and like the way that. You do? Yeah, I definitely do. I definitely have. Okay. I know that I could always change it. I could change it right now if I wanted to. Yeah. But, that's yeah. what I was going to say. Yeah, I definitely. Because it seemed like you were so disappointed. Well, I yeah, I, well, it was more it was more the dis like disappointment that like me using that name even didn't even do the purpose it needed to do for the people that I wanted it to do, you know. So it didn't. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. so I, they never they ended they never ended up using that bridge, but I ended mm -hmm. up just loving the way that like it sounded and and like just how affirming it made me feel. And so I I never get the E R I N situation at all, at all, at all. So, the e oh right, yeah, yeah, like somewhere. Yeah, no, me. look at you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm blessed to be able to um, <clears throat> transition and stuff, and be a little more stealth in my area, especially. So, yeah, I uh, I've learned to love my name and my last name, especially. I take a lot of pride in my last name, like in my family. Like we kind of like rewrote it, you know, like it was handed to someone with a bad reputation, like handed to my dad with a bad reputation. So then, oh. you know what I mean? So we were like, this is now what being a capener means. And it means you like, you never give up. And like, we have like mottos and like, I don't know, we just made it like a whole thing. So oh. I'm very, I'm very attached to my last name and pretty much. And that was like, so I, most, it, it, it bridged the gap, you know what I'm saying? And then it, mm -hmm. like after a while, I liked the way that it flowed and everything. So. I like yeah. it. Definitely going to keep it for sure. You know, maybe buy our merch. And, you know, maybe, maybe buy our merch down. Maybe. Maybe buy our merch down below. In the, down below. In the link down below. Is there merch? Oh my God. There might be. There, there might, might be, be merch. I, hold on. I have to go check the description right now. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Let's. Okay. Okay. I'll meet you there. Thank you.